Make Qatar your success story. Qatar offers many opportunities for migrant workers seeking employment. Here are some important things you should know to help make your time working in Qatar a success. You may have been offered a job through a recruitment agency or by a company, but remember that employers should pay recruitment fees and costs, not you. Recruitment fees cannot be deducted from your salary. If you have paid anything, report it to your company. A contract can look complicated, but it's important. Make sure you understand it before signing. Ask a friend for help if needed. The contract should have the same details as any job offer you received, and it should detail the work you will do, pay and benefits, accommodation and food, and expected working hours. And check carefully how long the contract is for. Your passport, Qatari ID card and ATM card are important too. They should be kept by you and no one else. It's important to keep copies, so taking photos is a good idea. You will come to Qatar to work, but you must rest too. You should work no more than eight hours a day, plus two hours overtime. You're entitled to one day off a week, usually Friday. Remember that summer is hot here. From the 15th of June to the 31st of August, you must not work outside from 11.30 a.m. to 3 p.m. Everyone should be paid into their bank account once a month for their work, and overtime should be paid at a higher rate. Any deductions must be justified. You are also entitled to paid leave and sick pay. Most workers can now leave Qatar without an exit permit. However, remember to agree with your employer any annual leave or final departure plans before you travel. For more information, or if you feel you have been unfairly treated, contact the Ministry of Administrative Development, Labour and Social Affairs, as we are here to help.